Picks and Parlay family, it's me, Detroit Lenny here. Talk a little NFL preseason action. We'll take what we can get. NFL Hall of Fame game. We're going to talk Texans and the Bears. <coughs> Excuse me. And to do that, we're going to bring in our guy, Mr. Cam Ross here. Talk a little NFL action. Cam Ross, I got to tell everybody, like, share, subscribe. Use promo code right there, L-E-N-N-Y-20. Saves you 20% off your entire purchase at checkout. Cam Ross, you're going to talk this wonderful game, Texans and the Bears. Total started at 40. Now it's at 31 and a half. Texans minus two. Hall of Fame game. It's something. It's better than nothing. What do you got, Cam? Yeah, it's for sure something. You know, uh, it's August, end of July coming on. Um, it's exciting to see the NFL. These these games are always tough. You know, you and I spoke about it before we came on about the depth chart and stuff like that. But uh, either way, I'm going to go with the Texans here. You know, the Texans, they are a deeper, more talented team. Um, at one time last year through week eight, they were three and four. They won seven of the last ten, finished ten and seven, got into the playoffs, beat the hell out of Cleveland in the first round. C.J. Stroud had an amazing rookie season, um, and I expect him to pick up, you know, pick up where he left off. Don't expect to see a whole ton of him, a whole lot of the big, the big show from them in this game. But um, on the other side, you know, Chicago, they've been bad for years. They've been terrible. Uh, they got rid of Justin Fields. <clears throat> Number one overall pick, Caleb Williams. You know, this will probably be his first sign, first showing in the NFL. I'm just going to go with the Texans here. I think the Texans have the depth. I think the Texans have the talent. I don't think the starters are going to play a whole terribly much, but I still think the Texans are the better overall team as they are coming off a playoff uh, appearance a year ago. They're going to look to repeat it. So I'm going to go with the Texans minus the two. With it being so low, you might even find the money line for a good enough price to mess with. Yeah, this number's all over the place. I see it anywhere from one to two to one and a half. Uh, you know, you can even get a four out there if you want to play some juice. But, <clears throat> excuse me. But I, I, I just, at this rate, the Texans are just a deeper team. I don't even care. I don't think any of the starters play. I don't think any of the ones play at all. And even that, the twos and the threes, we're going to take Houston here minus the two on the money line. Guys, don't forget, like, share, subscribe. Use that promo code, picksandparlays.net. Thanks for watching, everybody. Good luck unless you're against us.